What's up everyone? Welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Chris. So I have a new vendor to share. Yes, I know I said no more new vendors. And this is it. And the only reason I purchased was because I had some money in my shop pay available and I thought, well, I can go ahead and use that money and pay for it. So, hey, I thought that was a good idea. Um, unless I happen to like really like be insane and then want more. Or, yeah, let's not go there because I am truly working hard to make an effort to keep my purchases at a minimum. Because, number one, Sensi has a great, great lineup coming down the pipe and so many things that I want to get from them. And <clears throat> so, yeah, I plan on just doing my Scentsy, Knowles, Knowles um, Farm Scents, and Lavender and Speckles. I'm on her customs list, so when I get called up for that. And um, I'm even going to try to, I'm going to try really hard to avoid teddy bees as well. So, yeah, that's my plan. But I did go ahead and make this purchase from this new vendor. And this vendor is the Candle Nurse. Um, she does have a page here on um a channel here on YouTube. I'll link that below and I will also link her Facebook group page. So go ahead and join there and we could all learn together about all the great scents she's going to be pouring. All right, everybody, enough talking. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open my box because I'm really excited and uh, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, I'm back. So I was going to go ahead and take everything out of the box, but I'm not going to because I want to show you how this is packaged. Holy moly. She's got the, um, the foil mylar here, which kind of insulates it for heat. There's also a ice pack in here, which that was so generous. And oh gosh, how cute is this? Look at the strawberry tissue paper. Oh, I just love it. Some little um, gummy bears. I'll have my grandson this weekend, so I'm going to um, put this with this the candy I've been collecting for him. He's going to be excited. Oh, this is nice. So uh, the nice little card. Ooh! Your order made my day. I hope this pack package makes yours. Why don't you put a little note on here? Oh, so, oh, you are too sweet. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. It says, hi, Chris. I love your, I love your YouTube channel. Hashtag huge fan. Thank you so much for your purchase. Warm wax four weeks after the poor day, Emily. So Emily owns Candle Nurse. Here is her business card. And her name is Emily Dominguez. And Dominguez, why can't I pronounce that? I'm not, you know, it's not a hard name, but my tongue doesn't work. And on the back, it has all her social media links. And like I said, I will put her Facebook and her YouTube channel below. It comes with an invoice. Sticker there on the invoice. All right. Beautiful tissue paper. Got some pink worms. All right. Now I will unbox it. Like I said, everything is just beautiful. I love the bag she put her shapes in. They're like, they're heavy duty. They're like uh, vinyl. I'm getting there, guys. I'm getting there. Okay. We got some samples. Love samples. Samples are awesome because it's a way to, um, you know, try out new scents and 
many times I've repurchased things based on samples and it's so helpful and so very appreciated. All right, let's go ahead and check our samples first. Now, well, when I get to the bag zone. All right, so the first one is, oh, and Shiva puts the pour date on her samples, awesome. And this one is over heaven, over hell. All right. And this is sandalwood, creamy coconut, heliotrope, vanilla, cedarwood, tonka bean, patchouli, yes. Moss, bergamot, dried fruits, jasmine, amber, and musk. This sounds like nice. Oh, yeah. This is pretty, you guys. This is like, um... Oh, and I love the little shapes. How cute are these? They're like little flamingos. Ooh. Oh, this is pretty. So, it's... It's creamy. And you can smell the patchouli in here, but it's it's a pretty patchouli. It's not dirty patchouli. And it's sweet. It's creamy. It's got that earthiness from the patchouli. The sandalwood is coming through. Everything here is blended just beautiful. This would definitely be something I would purchase without a doubt. That's pretty. The next one we have is The Cellar. Now, The Cellar is malt apples, fresh fig, rosy nuances of pink pepper, warm musk, and cedar wood. I love musk. Oh, wow. You know what? This reminds me of something. This is gorgeous, you guys. This, oh my goodness. This almost has, ever so slightly, there's an incense vibe here, but not over the top incense. Because there's this sweetness that comes in. This is beautiful. Oh. Malt apples. That must be the sweetness. This is, and it's unique. This is something I don't have in my collection, nor have I smelled this before. That is incredible. All right. See, and I said I was gonna. Mm, this is where I get like really hung up, because. I want this. Oh my gosh. Different. Beautiful. Like I said, it's sweet. It's... Oh. It almost has an incense vibe. It's sweet. A little spicy, but not like bakery spice. Just spicy like you know oh gosh that's beautiful I haven't even gotten to what I ordered yet okay I don't have my glasses on and they're not in this room so this I believe says Mingus a sweet tea wheat sweet cream and it's creamy whipped vanilla hint of fruit tonka bean and sandalwood Oh, and I didn't show you how the samples, they're, oh, two pineapples. The wax is very clean, clean. And these are rose buds, like little rose blossoms. Ooh. This smells like a smoothie to me. I'm getting fruit smoothie. It smells good. Oh, I like that. 
definitely creamy super super creamy it says hint of fruit but I'm 100% I'm getting the fruit mm, this is gorgeous beautiful 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 I absolutely love this and I'm surprised because it's that creamy it's that vanilla whip creamy whip vanilla that I'm truly enjoying in this one Oh, that's fantastic. See, so far, three out of four samples, and I, I want to order now. <laughs> this next one is called Can't Go Home. This is Stone Fruit, Jasmine, Tuberose, Lily of the Valley, Amber, White Musk, Crystal Saffron, and Jasmine. Oh, and these are just spring flowers. These are beautiful. I love the samples. This smells like Baccarat Rouge. This smells like Baccarat Rouge 540. That was my first instinct when I smelled it. So that being said, you know I love this because I love that scent. That's what this smells like to me. I know there's saffron in Baccarat Rouge. I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> I'm taking too big. Too big of a sniff. This is pretty. This smells like Baccarat Rouge to me. I, I know there's saffron in Baccarat Rouge. And I believe there is jasmine too. Not quite. I don't really quite remember. Beautiful. Apps. If you like Baccarat Rouge 540, you will like this. So, I don't know how to explain the scent of that. It's it's very um, sultry. It's... There's a smokiness to it, even though there's no smoke in it. I don't know if it comes from the musk, but it feels smoky in a good way. It's just, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. All right. So I purchased six bags and the bags come with six shapes in them. Um, uh, see, I'm getting a phone call. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, all right, where was I? Oh, I was talking about her bags. So. They come in shape bags. Love the bags. They're thick. They're like, they feel like vinyl. Um, I don't remember how much they were. I think, I want to say $7.45, maybe. Like I said, I paid with my shop pay money that I had sitting in my account. But I think they were like $7.45 each. All right, so I got six. So I'm very excited to smell them because the way those samples were, I'm really excited. Okay, so the first one is Shadow of Your Heart. <laughs> you know what? I just finished up working for the day. It's almost 8 o'clock and yeah, I'm tired. So, But I wanted to get this done because I have a really busy weekend coming and I got a lot of orders coming this weekend too. Okay, Shadow of Your Heart. And this is Fire Roasted Marshmallow, Palo Santo. Crystal, Saffron, and Jasmine. Lovely label. She's got the pour date on there. Her website. I love her. The aesthetic is very nice. It's clean. And I like the color she's using. Alright, let's give this one a sniff. Oh, that's nice. So this is smoky, creamy. I like her Palo Santo. It's very nice. It's like um, it's not quite the cologne type Palo Santo, but 
just a hint. But that could also be the jasmine in here. It could be picking up the perfume from the jasmine. It's creamy. It's sweet. A little smoky. A little bit of perfume floral. Just, just a touch. Very nice. Mmm. like that one. All right. The next one I got is Bandit Panda. Again, I do like her, um, I like the aesthetic on here. Oh, uh, well, I'll show you in this one. This is Smoky Vanilla Embers in Humidor type and Creamy Vanilla. I never smelled Humidor and I thought, I'm getting that just because that sounds like something I'm going to like. <laughs> Ready. You do get that smoky vanilla ember. I like it. It is pouring rain here, you guys. Oh, that's beautiful. Um, there's almost like um a tobacco note here. Is that humidor? I don't know. But she's got the little shapes. They're like little mini bunt shapes. I don't know if you could see that. There's that, and we got a star. There's rose in there. You know, you guys know what the shapes look like. And if I didn't mention it, Emily is um, based in Arizona. Oh, this is beautiful. I like this one. It's like, like I said, it's smoky vanilla. You get that little bit of a fiery note there. Not a lot. You know, my house isn't burning down fire. It's just perfect. It, tobacco. And then it's just a nice creamy vanilla there. This is, oh, this is nice. I'm in trouble. This is why... <laughs> It's hard when you try a new vendor out because it's like, oh no. Okay. Next one is Purple Pillow Palace. And this one is Beach After Dark House Blend, Lavender Marshmallows, Iced Vanilla Woods Type, and Sweet Lavender. Mental. I'm very into doing all, trying all the lavender things now, guys. Oh. I'm really like blown away. So I'm going to assume that the Beach After Dark house blend is kind of like a Beach Nights vibe because I'm getting Beach Nights from this. The Ice Vanilla Woods in here is is lovely. It's um It's not overpowering the scent at all, but it's there and it's just adding just that, just the right touch of that icy woods. The lavender is beautiful. It's not in your face, over the top. It's sweet and floral. And you get the creaminess from the marshmallow. This is fantastic. Yeah, that's Purple Pillow Palace. I like the names of her blends too. Very unique. Okay. This next one is um, Maya Mac Dressed in Black. Now, see a trend here with me. This is Tobacco Leaves, Vanilla, Tonka Bean, Pink Sugar Type, and Sugar Cookie Royale. I love tobacco. I love smoke. And this one here, the sugar cookie with tobacco leaves. It's happy good. Oh, yes. That beautiful sweet sugar cookie. It's a nice sugar cookie. And then you get a little bit of earthiness from the tobacco leaves. I'm not picking up much of the pink sugar. 
which is fine. It's, I mean, it could be here and just making the blend just pretty. It's just a pretty blend. And my light looks awfully, you know, I thought so. It was starting to blind me. Oh, that's pretty. Mmm. A little creaminess from the vanilla. This is great. I would warm this through my whole house, but this would be very enjoyable in the bedroom as well. Then I've got Ashes to Ashes. And this one is by the fireplace type. Smoky Vanilla Embers, Toasted Marshmallows, Sugar Cookie Royale, and Palo Santo. Every single note in here, I love. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, just, I, I need to... This is, this is, yeah. It's beautiful smokiness. You get the by the fireplace, but it's not, sometimes by the fireplace, and not necessarily in a bad way, is smells like by the fireplace, which is a dupe of, um, replica it's a perfume and it's a very um smoky woody type perfume it's very fireplace <laughs> and in here it's just the essence of all that is here oh my gosh because you really get the sugar cookies coming out the palo santos coming out this is just a sweet smoky beautiful blend This is fabulous. Okay, and last but certainly not least, we've got Come On Sammy. This one is Smoky Vanilla Ember, Sandalwood, Cedarwood, Leather, Rich Amber, Palo Santo, and Creamy Vanilla. And this was poured in May. I am still going to wait. I will probably, these will probably come out in the fall for me. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Smoky vanilla embers. You get this beautiful creamy vanilla that is smoky, but you get those the embers from a fire. That fire note is here. Oh, my gosh. I like the leather in this. You definitely pick the leather up. It's not in your face. It's just there adding a little something to the the, the, the fragrance itself. It's making it feel um, cozy. It feels, it's like sitting in a lodge somewhere in a leather barca lounger and the fire's going and there's a sweetness in here this sweet creaminess unbelievable absolutely love this i almost passed up on ordering because i'm like nope nope i'm gonna stick to my stick to my plan and I kept, yes, I really want to try it. And I looked at the list and I'm like, oh my God, I really want to try it now because now I looked. This is unbelievable. Okay. Um, I'm glad I didn't, I'm glad I was lacking willpower as I usually do. It, it worked out well. <laughs> um... I could honestly say to you, and I mean honestly, I love every single scent I got. I love all these samples. Um, and to my nose, I don't, I can't sit and say, well, 
such and such, I have smell one that's kind of, I have something similar to this, or I have something similar to that. I don't have anything in my wax um, library that smells anything like these. These are all new to my nose. I can't say, oh, that's similar to so-and-so's blend of this or that. These are all fresh and new, and that excites me. Um, yeah, so... Again, the candle nurse, Emily, oh jeez, I have to read it to say it, my mouth is not working, Emily Dominguez, um, she's, out of, she's out of Arizona, and she is a nurse, or she was, I'm not sure, I think she may have said she left her full-time nursing job to start her wax business. Um, customer service is fantastic. Check her out. I'm going to put her Facebook group. I'm going to put her YouTube channel down below as well as her website. So yeah, definitely worth trying. This is one, this is a vendor I would recommend to try. I don't think you'll be disappointed at all. She, this is, yeah, these are some fabulous scents. Fabulous. And I'm really looking forward to melting it. Being the type of scents I got, I'm going to try to hold out to September. <laughs> and uh, warm them then. So, keep your eye out for some warm reviews. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. And I appreciate the time you take out of your day, your lives, and your busy schedules. And you watch a video I've uploaded because that really means a lot to me. And it helps the channel grow. Please comment, like, and subscribe. That also helps my channel grow as well. And um, so, yeah, have a great weekend, weekday, weeknight, whenever you happen to be watching. And we will chat again real soon. Bye-bye.